Come join us Saturday, December the 10th at 10 a.m. at 822 Bogle Road in Woodbury, Tennessee. We'll be auctioning a three-bedroom home, two acres with a 30 by 50 mechanic shop. We'll have tools, tractors, equipment, and personal property. Household items, everything you could think of. There'll be something for everyone. You don't want to miss this sale. The home consists of over 2,200 square living feet, three bedrooms, two baths, two-car garage, above-ground pool, two acres of land, and we also have a 30 by 50 mechanic shop. Of course, we have wide driveways, turn around RVs, drivers, whatever you need. We'll be here December the 10th at 10 a.m. The shop measures 30 by 50 steel shop with wide driveway, and of course, we got the shed on the side where the tractor's being stored. That is a Dutz 5206 tractor, three-cylinder, diesel engine, about 700 hours on the tractor. This property has an extra wide driveway. If you've got an RV, fifth wheel be perfect for pulling in, turning around. If you've got a trailer you need to park, plenty of parking room. And like I said, this is just the front of the property, the two acres. And like I said, it sits on two acres right on the Cannon Warren County line. Excellent location, excellent convenience in and out of the property. Of course, we have the above ground pool. We have a large deck, as you'll see. Let me, scan, let me zoom out here a little bit on the deck. It is completely privacy fenced. It is attached to the back of the home by a covered porch. And you also have a walkway. We will be selling all the porch furniture, the grills, the planters. We'll be, moving, we'll be selling all of this today at sale on December 10th. As I said, the property includes two acres of land. The land is completely open. It is fenced. If you had pets, small animals, it's perfect for that. But it will be selling the house with two acres of land and a 30 by 50 shop will be selling together. Starting at real estate will be offered at 12 o'clock noon. Check out the mini chopper, chrome, custom paint, runs up to about 50 miles an hour down the road. We also have an electric Eagle scooter, great for the campground, wherever you want to use it. Of course we have the 10 speed mountain bike, cross country bicycle. We have an edger, and ladies and gentlemen that is a Craftsman I believe edger. We also have a Craftsman uh, weed mower here. Right here is our six foot pool table. Pool table is in excellent condition. The cloth is excellent. The green's good. The balls and sticks are included with the table. We've also got an assortment of variety of items in the garage. It's miscellaneous. We got a six-foot fiber optic Christmas tree back here in the back. We got two of those. They're six-foot fiber optic Christmas trees. As you go to the front of the garage here, we've also got some metal. Well, what do you call them here? What we like to call them? Rolling cages. Be great for consignment stores or just putting parts in, whatever you need them for, clothes, hampers, whatever you need. They do have wheels on them, they do roll. We've got seven of those. They're in excellent condition, no rust on them whatsoever, and they all have wheels. Here we have the Wolf System 16 bulb tanning bed. It is currently in the house, which they have sell. It will be out to where you can inspect it, but it does work. All the bulbs are good on it. This is a Maytag washer and dryer. It is a Maytag Centennial commercial technology. We have one said Maytag here in the house. We also have another Maytag, a different model, out in the shop area. We will also be selling, so we'll be selling two sets of washers and dryers. This is a Whirlpool 20 cubic foot freezer. It is frost free. We will be selling it. It will be outside day of the sale. It is working. Uh, we will have it unplugged day of sale, of course, because it will be sitting out in the yard. But it's a 20 cubic foot Whirlpool frost free freezer. As we enter the living room at home, we, all, we will be selling all the household furniture. We have a, a two lazy boys or two actual recliners uh, that will foot extends. We have a sofa, of course, full size sofa, coffee table, and chair with ottoman. We will be selling the household furniture. It will be outside also day of the sale. This is the Dutz 5206 tractor. It is a three-cylinder diesel-powered tractor. Very good condition, about 700 hours. Starts and purrs like a kitten.
We will also be selling implements. This is a Ford post hole digger with 9 inch auger. It is a heavy duty model, excellent condition, works perfectly. Here we have the 6 foot box blade. It's a heavy duty model with 3 point hitch. Here we have the Craftsman dump driver. It fits the 26 horsepower Craftsman garden tractor we will be selling. Here ladies and gentlemen we have an assortment of items. First item we have is a parts washer. In the back you'll notice the, the mowing deck for the Craftsman 26 horsepower garden tractor we'll be selling. We also have a small disc right there. We have two engine stands. Those are two separate engine stands. Disc for that tractor. It does have a, it's a single plow width disc. There's an aerator, yard aerator. There is also a four, four foot scraper blade. That right there is right there. It'll be out there so everybody can see it real good. As far as regular tractor implements, we have the six foot bush hog. That goes with the, that will be selling separately from the tractor. As you'll see, there is a central heat and air unit on the shop. That is a central air unit. It is not heat. The heat provided to the shop is gas heat. Uh, it will be provided through a propane tank. You will have to provide your own propane tank, but there is a propane heater inside the shop. As we scroll over, we also have the upright air compressor. This is wired up straight into the breaker box. It is a 220. It is a Porta Cable, we believe, a Porta Cable brand air compressor. We also be selling this large uh, oil tank. The owner of the property used to own a car shop here. He kept his spare oil. He's used oil in this tank. This will also be sold day of the sale. It will be up to the buyer to remove this tank from the premises within five days of the sale. Here we have a sweeper for the 26 horsepower Craftsman. And we also have a wheelbarrow and a thatcher. The thatcher does have blocks we used to put on it for weight. They will be sold. They are right there. You can see those. They do have the chains on them already. Great, easy to set up on top of the thatcher or the small disc. It also goes with the 26 horsepower Craftsman. The hay ring for cattle or whatever you might want to use it for will be sold day of sale. It will be sold by itself. We have one metal hay ring. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the 26 horsepower Craftsman garden tractor we have. If you notice, it does have a three-point hitch on it. And as we showed you a minute ago, the mower blade, the mower deck, and everything is outside. We will be offering that also the day of the sale. I believe the engine, let's check it out. I believe it does have a Kohler engine, but we'll make sure on this. It is a Craftsman Kohler Pro engine. It is a Kohler 26 horsepower V-twin engine. Very clean machine. Excellent condition. Here, ladies and gentlemen, we have a Towmaster car dolly. This car dolly has never been used. It is brand new. Of course, it's never had a car on it. And it's got the straps included with it also, and the tongue with chains and hydraulic braking system. These items on the table, ladies and gentlemen, we'll be selling individually. We have many items. We have scroll saws. We have truck steps, adjustable tow bars. Uh, pulling shrub trimmer. We have lots of tools here. We'll be going down the row here and looking. We have laser levels. We have drill bits. Just about anything you think of, we'll probably have it there. So we have a bow stitch nailer. Of course, we have a lot of Mac tools, Mac scan tools. This is a car scanner. Here we have Mac tool and die sets. We'll open these up for you. This is a metric tool and die. We have another set of map tool and dice kit here, a larger set. As you can see, it's in excellent condition. Machine screw fractional taps and dies by Mac Tools. In excellent condition with the case. We have a Mac, of course, a Mac airbrush kit. We have a Mr. Heater here. We have jack stands. We have Dremel, Dremel tools. We have a Bosch jigsaw. Bosch electric sander, Makita electric drill, of course Norm Mac pullers, we have Mac Noid lights, 
We have work lights with the cords, retractable cords. We have a professional UV leak kit, vice laser. Here is the Mac air cutoff tools. Mac grinders, Mac air cutoff tools. We have battery testers. We have paint guns, sanders, all types of buffers. Another cutoff tool. Of course, we have a Dremel Multimax, a very large puller. We have another Mac pulling system. This is a Mac steering wheel service set. It's in excellent condition, original boxes. All the pieces are there. We have a Craftsman 12 volt cordless drill with charger with two batteries, excellent condition. Of course, we have our roadside emergency kits. We have our various different toolboxes for different wrenches, different things. We have two Delta bench grinders. As we go around the room here, this is a Mac transmission jack, two-stage transmission jack. We have a Campbell Hospital pressure washer. If you'll notice, we have a set of two skis in the back back here. I'm not much of a skier, but we do have a set of two skis. We have a small Craftsman toolbox. We also have a Makita metal cutoff saw. Makita brand metal cutoff saw. And of course, we have an assortment of Mac, different Mac little tools here, drill bits and different things like that. We'll be selling those items also. Okay, I'm sure this is the item most people will be interested in. We have a Mac toolbox. This is a very large toolbox and a very expensive toolbox when it was purchased new by the owner. As you can see, it's multi-drawers, very large, very wide. It does have the radio and speakers in it, of course, storage in the doors. As we go around, this toolbox will have tools in it day of the sale. Of course, we can't specify exactly what will be in it. You'll just have to come and see for yourself. But it will be selling the day of the sale. Right now, it's a limited edition. It is a limited edition Mac toolbox by Mac Tools. It is very nice and excellent condition. Like I said, the drawers work very well. It's loaded down with tools. It will be loaded down day of the sale. Here we have a bench vise, very large bench vise. It is unbolted from the table. It will be selling day of sale. We have assorted clean carb cleaners, chemicals, uh, Lucas Oil products. We also have a little drill press here, a tabletop drill press. We have another bench vise. Of course, here is a Delta drill press. Uh, the owner just didn't notify us this week that the pulley did break on this drill press so it does not function properly. It was functioning properly. He did have a pulley break just this week. Other than that, the drill press does work. As we go around the room here, you'll see some more items. It's kind of hard to get around here. Just a minute here. Here we have a Femco sprayer, and this is, of course, a tractor supply brand sprayer. It's about a 25-gallon sprayer. It does have the uh, boom on it to where it comes out. Good garden sprayer, yard sprayer, field sprayer, whatever you might need it for. As we go around the floor here, of course, you see we have a Mac. This is a Mac, three and a half ton four jack with the foot pump on it. Uh, these are very rare now to find in this good of quality. We have a lawn mower, yard machines, Briggs and Stratton lawn mower, push mower. Everybody loves those. We have a little spray tank there with a card on it for hauling it around. This is our engine stand. This is a Viking engine stand. It's in excellent condition, works fine, no problems whatsoever. If we walk around the room here, we have a, a generator. Don't know exactly what brand it is. It's an older style generator. It does have some mechanical issues, but it could work. It's in very good condition other than that. Here is our Viking. This is a Viking 60,000 60, pound shock press. Very good shock press, works perfectly. We also sell some heavy, very heavy duty jack stands down here. These are super big, great for working on three quarter ton, ton trucks, whatever you might have, tractors, be great for that. Of course, we have different jacks as you can see in the shop. We have grease guns. We have just about anything you could want as a mechanic. Of course, we have two settling tanks for welding on their own dolly there. They are strapped to the dolly. They'll be sewing with the dolly. Both tanks will be sewing together with the dolly. Here we have a steam cleaner and a vacuum cleaner. Those will be sewing. We have a portable air tank. As a nine gallon portable air tank, it does work. We have jump starters. We have two jump starters. There's one. There's the other one. We got bumper jacks. We got wheel jacks. 
we got product manuals from different makes and models of Toyota pickups, Dodges, Toyota Camrys, Ford Contour, Chevrolet, and GMC. Lots of different uh, workbooks on our, our work manuals there. The bins, the spoke bins, will be sold in four sections here. We have four sections. They are strapped to the wall right now. We will be taking those off. We will be selling them like they are with what they have in them. We will not be emptying them out. But they will be selling in four different sections. If you'll notice in the picture, you can see that there are four sections of these. They will be selling individually. Here we have another boat bin. Difference got uh, one, two, three, four, six drawers on it. These drawers do work well. They slide great. As you can see, they are in excellent condition. They're not completely full, but they do have a lot in them. They will be selling as they are. This will be selling as one complete unit. This has got connectors, fasteners. It's got them labeled. Soldier terminals. We'll also be selling the automotive hose clamps. We got two stacks of those. Well, the Ralby router, I'm sorry, Ralby router. Here's the table saw. Ralby 10 inch table saw is right there. We have a DeWalt cutoff saw, excellent condition, works perfectly. Nothing wrong with that whatsoever. And down here we have a Briggs and Stratton 14 horsepower. It is a horizontal shaft, tapered shaft motor. 14 half horsepower, 14 horsepower, tapered shaft, horizontal shaft motor. Here we have the metal work table. This will be selling also by itself. We have a little Mac Tools push around work cart. We will also be selling that. Here we have the 9,000 pound two post lift. This lift will be selling separately from the real estate. Whoever buys the lift is responsible for moving it. It is a two post lift. It is in excellent condition, works perfectly. It is a 9,000 pound forward brand two post lift. As I said before, the shop is heated by propane heat. This is the propane heater on the inside of the shop. Of course, like I said, you would have to have a propane tank to deliver a rental with a propane company uh, to heat the shop, but it does have central air conditioning. We'll also have lots of miscellaneous items, bolts, screws, wires, you know, a lot of different things like this that we will be boxing up and selling individually, oil filters, different things like that, uh, oil products, fuel injection cleaners, things like that. We'll also be selling, we got a box of wheels here for lawnmower decks, we've got plumbing supplies, belts, hoses, just about anything you can think of, wire ties, different things here. And on this side of the room, if you'll notice, we scroll around, we're going to have different chemicals, we've got rust oleum, we've got paint thinners, we've got spray paint, uh, different things, like I said, we'll be selling those. Here we have a box of fans down here. That is a box of electric fans, and we do have two kerosene heaters that are under this stack right here. This is the second of the washer and dryer sets. It also, it's a Maytag Performa. It is a washer and dryer set that we'll be selling. It is currently in the back of the shop. Uh, like I said, if somebody buys the real estate and they want to keep the washer and dryer, suggest a bid on it because it will be sold separately from the real estate. But it is a washer and dryer Maytag performance in excellent condition also. On this side, we do have a refrigerator. It is a smaller, older refrigerator. Makes a great shop refrigerator. It does work in excellent condition. Cooling as it is plugged in, it is working.